Now I have the honor of turning to the master, Hermeto Pasquale. And I'm gonna take my time because I, I enjoy doing this. <laughs> you are known universally as Obrujo, the sorcerer. Every musician who has worked with you throughout your long career has been forever touched by your magic. You are a towering central figure in the history of Brazilian music. Though your influence and your creativity is felt in every corner of the world. You were born in Arapiraca, a small and poor rural village in the semi-arid northeast of Brazil. Drawn to the sounds of nature from a very early age, you actually created a flute from a pumpkin stem to play for the birds around your home. As a small child, you took spare materials from the shop of your blacksmith grandfather and used them to make music. At the age of seven, you experimented with your father's accordion. Those explorations started an eight decade musical ascension as a composer, arranger, band leader, and multi-instrumentalist. Well, you moved to the big southern cities of Sao Paulo and Rio de Janeiro in the 50s and 60s during the height of the Bossa Nova movement. With your talent and restlessness, you changed the international soundscape forever, expanding the harmonic aspirations of Bossa Nova to heighten tensions and deepen resolutions with ever more fundamental and complex forms. Y'all just heard a fantastic example of it. You also brought sounds previously considered non-musical, like natural noises and the myriad recurring timbres of life right into the mainstream of Brazilian music. In addition to your enormous abilities as an improviser, you also contributed to a quantitative and qualitative leap in the scoring of your country's music. And even though your sight is impaired by congenital myopia, you are just a compulsive composer with a constant flow of fresh ideas which you write on paper napkins, concert programs, hats. You even gave me some tennis shoes with a composition on it. <laughs> and you draw your compositions like artwork on the walls that you pass. Every day, anyway, anywhere and everywhere, you write with intensity and with a burning, unquenchable fury. Man, <laughs> your colorful and diverse music has transformed the percussion universe. Before you, great percussionists thought mainly of rhythm and groove. But you opened up this traditional concept and encouraged them to introduce new sounds that brought images, landscapes, and atmospheres of everything, from the sounds of birds to the howling of nocturnal animals to the organized chaos of a popular marketplace. Exalted master, Hermeto Pasquale. Your music goes far beyond any one style to encompass Choro, Bayao, Bossa Nova, Maracatu, Frevo, and a wholly original jazz and symphonic palette where improvising meets rigorous written forms. You said, I don't play one style, I play nearly all of them. Well, you've mastered multiple traditional instruments, but you also play teacups, wood found objects, whatever catches your imagination. You even caught on a recording, ham boning on a high and low pitched couple of actual pigs. <laughs> this is true. <laughs> you know, <laughs> throughout your career, throughout your career, you've created numerous definitive groups. You've collaborated with musicians like Flora Purim, Gilberto Gil, and Miles Davis. You've also worked with every major Brazilian musician, yet on your most recent tours, you spotlight and celebrate the very youngest musicians and celebrate the younger generation. You've been honored with multiple Grammy Awards and have played at every major international festival in the world, traveling across North and South America, Europe, and Asia. We're immensely fortunate that you graced us with a residency in Juilliard Jazz this winter that resulted in two complete programs of your music it was elevatory and transformative for students and teachers alike. 
old Brazilian bard of rhythm and tune. You embrace the entire world of music with boundless joy and imagination. <laughs> You've said it comes from the universe. That's why I call it musica universal. It's an energy that never stops. It hovers over us wherever we are. Mr. Hermeto Pascual, you call everyone you see the champ, but you are the true champion, an actual wizard and sorcerer whose music has given our world a much more comfortable seat in the cosmos. Obrigado. Janet Alvarez. 